Welcome back. Here's a question which tests your understanding of three different elasticities of demand. So let's have a look at the question. A product is described as an inferior good with no close substitutes. We're also told it's a complement to good X. So which product A, B, C or D matches the above description? Press the pause button, have a go at the question and I'll be back in a few seconds with the right answer and the explanation. And the correct answer to this question is, it's D. Let's look at the answer. We're given some information. So go back to the stimulus material. We're told, first of all, the product is an inferior good. Well, an inferior good has a negative income elasticity of demand. Uh, <clears throat> demand falls as income goes up. So the answer must be C or D. We can eliminate A and B. We're also told that this product is a complement to good X, a complement as opposed to a substitute. A cross price elasticity of demand for two complements is always negative. If the price of good X goes up, for example, that would cause people to buy less of good X and also less of the complementary good. So we're looking for an option which gives us a negative income elasticity of demand and a negative cross price elasticity of demand with respect to the price of X. And of course, the answer is D.